We'll have to go back into Leith at some point and figure out if I just murdered that woman's husband. Highly possible. Um, and if there's a drunk man down the well. That's where I'm at. <laughs> Hey guys, Taylor here, and today we're jumping back into Harvestella. Why is there no sound? Oh. Because <laughs> oh my headphones are unplugged. <laughs> what? Oh god, why am I so dumb sometimes? Ah, I swear I'm not dumb. I have a master's degree. Let's try that again. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> we should be jumping back into a cutscene. Yep. Here we go. We're gonna figure out what that book is for. How's it going, Taylor? Good to see you're awake finally. Girl likes to sleep, I don't know. So, ta-da, what do you think? <laughs> when did that book get here? I worked all night while you were asleep to carry it here. You don't mind, right, Taylor? Cause I've got something even more important to tell you. I'm gonna write a wish list oh, of stuff I'd like you to do, and you're gonna do it! Wow. Okay. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why don't you just do it yourself, all-powerful fairy? Well, isn't it obvious? I'm trying to inspire your day-to-day. -day. It's fun having goals to work towards, right? This sounds like manipulation. <laughs> but I know you're pretty stingy? So if it helps get you moving, then I'll be dishing out rewards, too. Wow, Ember, that was rude. Like, hmm, oh, my help with the farm work. Or, or, I can give you super helpful tool recipes. Wow, isn't the power of the Great Fairy terrific? You're gonna have so much fun with this. An avocado. Thanks. <laughs> Look forward to seeing what you can do. Fairy orders. You can check fairy orders from the fairy book in your house. You can notify them once you have fulfilled an order by pressing A. You receive compensation once you have fulfilled a certain number of orders. I heard this is actually really important, so thanks, but it just sounds like manipulation, I'm gonna be honest. Okay, let's check it out. Oh, I've done some. Oh, and I get- hold on, hold on. Okay, so we've done some, so we're gonna get a present. Fermenting barrel recipe, flour mill recipe. So I think that's our next present right there. And we should get it because we've done these. Wow, you did it. Yeah, okay, so fermenting barrel recipe, flour mill recipe, perfect. Next is plow skill charge level one, interesting. Wow, you did it. I don't know what that means, but we did it. <laughs> And then next is stamina down. Oh, okay, that's nice. So hers is just looks like, oh, there's more stuff down here. Make a return bell. We could do these easily. Oh, good, it tells me, because I was like, I don't know. With the hoe equipped, hold Y to charge. Then release it to plow, nice, a wider area in one shot. Processors. Create processed goods by putting material into the processor installed on the farm. What you can put in, what you can take out, and how long it'll take all depends on the type of processor you use. You can craft a processor after you get the recipe for it. Okay, perfect. Oh yeah, we are in a cutscene. I forgot. Wow, that was fast. Thanks for completing an item on my wish list. You're welcome. I already gave you a handy dandy tool recipe before, so how's this? Oh, okay. You can pop these carrots into a drink maker to make vegetable juice. Not only is it super yum, but vegetable juice replenishes your endurance, too. I can drink juice until it pours right out of my ear, so hop to it. Wait, so this is for your benefit? Hey, 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 you'll be happy drinking yummy juice, too, you know. Anyway, that's what the berries are for. I'll be waiting for you to get that drink maker. I don't... Did I get that recipe? Hold on. Today is not going to be the day that... Um we go to the heaven's egg. That's where we left off. We were gonna investigate the heaven's egg. I think we'll spend the day farming and checking around town, upgrading so we can get the cooking, and then we'll go from there. But 
I am gonna make a return bell because I can. And it was one of the fairy orders. We did it! Let's make a repair kit too because I think it's good to have those on hand in case we go to a dungeon that needs it. Now, is the fermenting barrel the drink maker? Let's make both of them. We can afford to make both of them. Let's do it. Install this machine on your farm and add fruit or vegetables to make drinks. Okay, yeah, so that's it. And then we'll make a flour mill as well. Um, I did see people like in the Reddit planning out their farms. I'm so excited, but it makes me nervous because I don't want to put down trees because you can't like pick them up and move them. You have to destroy them. So I'm like not going to put trees down yet. <laughs> Install this machine on your farm and add stellar wheat to make flour. Okay, and that's the other thing we'll do. We will go install the um, kitchen. Cool, look. Did we, what is it? Stamina down. Is that enough? No! <laughs> We're one short. Is there something we can do? Refurbish the kitchen counter. We're gonna do that. So we'll be good. We got mail! I'm taking care of a child? Meet me at the Jade Forest? What? Who could have written this letter? Yeah. Try going to the Jade Forest to find out more. Oh my god, now I'm like, I want to know. <laughs> this is my child. Dang it. Oh, I need to do the heaven's egg. Keeping your appointments. I didn't make an appointment. I know you're busy traveling all over the world, but it's about time you came back for a checkup. Who knows the state of your health is in now. I know you're sick of hearing it, but your health comes first. You can't adventure when you're bedridden, right? Don't forget to visit the clinic, understand? Okay, well, we're going to town today, so we can do that. Hold on, I can see my history. I wanna, did I read that? I'm taking care of the child. Yeah, that's, all right. That is very interesting. Maybe we will have time to do that. Looks like some of the crops are ready for harvest. Yeah, I know. What do you think I'm doing? Do I have any seeds? No, but let's put these down. Hmm, maybe over here. That's the right way. Nice. Okay. And we made something else, right? Yeah, here it is. A flour mill. Let's put that down right here too. Yeah. Let's put some stuff in. Okay. I don't have wheat. I really haven't kept any wheat. Oops. <laughs> I've been selling everything. Throw in one. I can only throw in one, but I know you can upgrade that and get more. So that's cool. And now I want to go to town and like buy a bunch of seeds because I can finally cook. Okay, to town. To town. To town. We'll Bye -bye. upgrade the kitchen. I hate, I hate that. That needs to not be a thing. Girly is scary. For such a pretty girl, you're quite scary. Okay. Oh, let's finish this quest. I think we'll be finishing it. Maybe not. Everybody here? Great. Then let's go to Malika's house. I really hope she likes it. We're giving her a present to say sorry because they think she's mad at them, but she's not. Can you stop, Nelly? Nelly Bobali, please stop. There's no one there. There's no one there. Hey, Malika! We've got something to show you! It's something shiny. Van, Van, uh, huh, hold on just a moment. Is it just me or does she sound rushed? Mom told me that girls need extra time to get pretty and stuff. Maybe that's why? She's a child, so I don't think that's why. <laughs> sorry to keep you waiting. It's no problem. Honestly, don't you know it's rude to turn up at a girl's house unannounced? Why did you bring Taylor with you? Well, rude. They have something important to say. What? What could be so important that they have to tell me right now? I'm trying to be nice. Don't be rude. Hey, Taylor, you're really starting to stress me out. I'm trying to help. Look, Malika. What is up with you two? You look like you're about to cry. We're super sorry. Huh? What are you apologizing for? We got you this. Here, please take it. Wow, it's so pretty. It's like a jewel. Is this really for me? This is wonderful. Thank you. But it still doesn't answer my question. What are you apologizing for? And what's with this surprise present? Well, you see... We've been going, you've been going home a lot earlier recently. We figured we'd done something to upset you without realizing. Huh. 
so we wanted to make it up to you. Will you still be our friend? But I'm not angry. What? You're kidding. <laughs> Sound effects. <laughs> so dramatic. <laughs> I'm really not. I'm not even the slightest bit angry. So, so then we... We got it all wrong? Ha ha. So that's why you guys went and found that stone. Such doofuses? Don't think I'm going to give it back to you, though. I'm going to treasure this. Always. Do what you like with it. As long as it makes you happy, Malika. Hee hee hee. I'll take good care of it. Is that all you came here for? Oh yeah, pretty much. In that case, I'll see you both tomorrow. Bye bye. We're not gonna figure out why she's going... What's wrong with her? No? I'm just gonna move on? Aw, what the heck was that? All our hard work wasted. You made Malika happy, though. That's right. She was really happy. Our hard work really paid off. He's shaking his head no. Eh, whatever. If it was just a misunderstanding, then that ain't so bad. I'm glad that worked out so well. Guess we should head home. Race you to the fountain. We'll catch up with you there, too, Taylor. I still gotta give you your reward. Oh no, from a child? What's a child gonna get me? Hopefully it's seeds, honestly. So that's it. We're just not gonna figure out why she was being so sneaky? Okay. Hi, Renovator. You don't have a name. Makes me sad, but... Um, can you make me a kitchen? Yes? Thank Please, you. Come again. I will. Welcome. I will come again, sir. Okay, cool. So that'll be ready in a day. Um, let's go back to these kids. Is that the kids? Oh, no. Who the heck is this? Is this Malika's mom? Oh, my. Whatever should I do? I should. I suppose I should tell the mayor. <laughs> Just leave her alone. <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, Taylor, I'm glad you're here. There's something I'm worried about. You know that house on the outskirts of the village? The one that's unoccupied? It's right at the bottom of that road over there. They're all unoccupied. Have you tried to go in any of the houses? They're empty. Okay. I think I might have seen it. Great. That makes things a lot easier. I haven't, but it's fine. It'll tell me where to go on the map. <laughs> well, the thing is, there's been a weird rumor going around that that empty house... Apparently, people keep hearing noises coming from it at night. Maybe someone moved in. I thought so, too, at first. But there really doesn't seem to be anyone living there. It can be only one thing. Ghosts! That house is haunted. Yep, that's it. That's the only reason. That's it. There could be no other possible reason there's noise coming from that house. Sure. It's probably just some mice. Don't be so mean. Well, I only had mean options, to be honest. <laughs> Won't you hear me out? You might not believe me, but I have good reason to believe it's a ghost. You see, before that house got abandoned, the man who used to live there was a mercenary. But he got sent out of a town on a mission once and never came back. So you think that's his ghost? That's my suspicion. So I wanted to ask you, Taylor, would you mind going to have a look at that house? No one else seems to be taking this rumor seriously. I wonder why. Sure. Thanks, that would be great help. Thanks, Taylor. Alright. Well, it looks like this day is gonna be quests. Let me know if you find anything, okay? Okay. Alright. So, let's go this way. Hello? Hello? Taylor, I've gotta say thank you for all your help back there. That's right. Thank you so much for helping us today, Taylor. It's been a couple of days, but it's fine. I'm just glad Malika wasn't mad. I don't know what we would have done if she actually was. What's up? It looks like something bothering you. We never asked why Malika leaves early. Yeah. Oh no, you're right. I totally forgot. I guess at least we know she isn't angry at any us or anything. Maybe it isn't any of our business. She did say she'll see us tomorrow. Hmm, nope. I can't let this go. <laughs> but Van, I've got to go and ask her why. If I don't do it now, then it's going to keep me up all night. Whoa, whoa Van, wait up. We've got to catch up with him, Taylor. Okay. We're going to walk right back to her house. That was pointless. We could have just done it then. I'm lost. 
I used to know my way around here, but I'm lost now. Let's go see Cress. What does she want? Hello? Where are you? There you are. No. Where is she? Do I have to go upstairs? Whoa, I didn't even know we could go upstairs. Is she in here? Hello? It's just a room. Okay. Where is she? The map is gone now. I don't know. Is she in here? Did I miss her? Is she down? I just missed her, I think. I'm dumb. Where is she? Raz. <laughs> oh my god, she's right there. I missed her. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I was not snooping, I swear. Good to see you, Taylor. I'm glad you came by for a checkup. We'll have to keep monitoring you for a while to see how you're recovering. I don't think I need a checkup. Well, last time I checked, I was the doctor here. Let me do my job. I think you just want to see me. Crest gives you a medical exam. All done. It looks like you're recovering smoothly. I couldn't find anything wrong with you. I was seriously worried about you when I saw you collapse to like that time. Thank goodness you found me. Well, the best way to thank me is to keep coming in for your checkups. Now, on to payment. For, for today's medical exam, it will be around this much. I have to pay. Well, of course. We doctors don't work for charity. Then I'm not coming in for checkups. Oh, well. I suppose I'll just have to keep scraping by to keep this office going then. You don't look like you're struggling. Well, I wouldn't want to worry my patients. What would you think if your doctor looked like they were struggling? But I mean, I'm doing fine with the everyday expenses. So what do you need the money for then? It's kind of nosy, but I guess I'm going to ask. Hey now. I can understand, yeah. I can understand your curiosity, but you can't just ask people such personal questions out of the blue, you know? Yeah, sorry, that was... Uh, I just remembered I haven't charged you for the first time I treated you yet either. My, my, you owe me quite a lot of money. Uh oh. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. I'm not that mean. Alright, let's make a deal. You help me out in exchange for the medical exams. Deal? Do you want me to help at the clinic? Yes, nothing you can't handle, just the odd jobs here and there. Collecting materials for me and things like that. I'll write to you when I have something for you to do. Thanks. Okay, that's fine. Sounds easy enough. The rumored physician. Why is she the rumored physician? She is the physician. Is she not really a doctor? Huh. Okay, well, we got close with her for that. Pyro liquid. Whoa. <laughs> Bonding with your party. Among the quests will be some requests from your party members. Completing your party members' requests deepens your bond with them. Strengthening your bond with your party members unlock special skills. Okay. Let's go buy some seats. I don't know how much I can afford, but let's see how much I can afford. What time is it? 12 o'clock. We're doing good. All right. We definitely need some wheat. How much money do I have? I don't have much. So let's do this. Let's also get some onion onion seeds. Dang, that's all our money. Let's just get one. <laughs> okay, thanks. <laughs> so broke. Is that Malika's house? Like way up the hill? Or is this the abandoned house? I guess we'll find out. This might be the abandoned house. I don't see where I'm supposed to go for Malika's quest, so we're going to the abandoned house. Yeah, this has to be the abandoned house. Where that? This looks like the rumored house. There's no one around. You enter the house. Oh, I'm just breaking and entering. <laughs> it's empty. It looks very tidy for an abandoned house. Oh, someone's coming in. Who's there? I've seen you before. You're that outsider that just came to our village. What are you doing in here? I hope you weren't planning on stealing anything. I came here looking for the ghost. Ghost? You think I'm stupid? There's no ghost in this house. Okay, get out now. Uh, 
This is someone's house. It's not for people like you to come in when they feel like it. I'm sorry. Are you related to the owner? That's none of your business. Now get out. Okay. Don't come near this house again. Yeah, I'm sorry. I kind of just broke. I did break into that house. Can we at least talk? There's nothing to talk about. It doesn't look like she'll talk to you anymore. Oh. For now, let's tell the lady who sent you what happened. Okay. There's someone that lives there, ma'am. Ma'am, I- Oh, it's right here. Okay, let's do this. Ban, there you are. Why are you hiding? Shh, look over there. What are you doing? Quick gawking and look at Malika's house. Why, what's going on? She's going somewhere with her parents. So, it's decided? Yes, I found us a nice house in Chitola I think you'll both love. Oh, she's moving. In Chitola, I guess I'll get to work on my tan. Haha, <laughs> don't you think you're a little young to be concerned with that? Yeah. <laughs> Chitola's right by the sea, so you'll have lots of places to explore. Being able to swim in the sea whenever I like does sound like a lot of fun. In that case, I guess you'll have no problem helping us pack. Sure. We've all got to do our part. And I'll need to inform the mayor. It's only going to get busier from here. She's moving. Th they're moving? But how can we play together every day if she moves to Shatola? You can't. Come on, you two. It's time to go home. Yeah, yeah. You don't need to tell me. I guess. I'll see you tomorrow, Van. Sure. Nice! We got some more money! I did not need to buy seeds. <laughs> okay, well. It's not that bad, I guess. Alright. Ma'am, there's someone living in that house, like I said. Ah, Taylor, how's it going? Did you find out anything about the house? Well, it wasn't a ghost. What was it then? I'm dying to find out. It was a woman. You tell her what happened at the house. Yeah, I broke into this woman's house because of you. I see. The noise makes sense now. I never would have thought that the ghost... What? I mean, the person going in and out of the house would be Sharon. Who's Sharon? She's the lady you met at the house. Okay, no doubt that's not what I meant. Now come to think of it, it's so obvious it was her. Now I feel awful. awful. The whole village has been gossiping about her. Why has Sharon been going to the house? It's not my place to say, sorry. If you want to find out, you should ask her yourself. Okay. What, she mistook you for a burglar and won't talk to you now? Well, yeah, that's your fault. I'm sorry for sending you in there. I don't think, I didn't think there was anyone inside. But you're right, it's not good to leave things like this. Oh, I've got it. A reward. Did you think of something? I'm not gonna be rude. Sharon always goes fruit picking in the jade forest. She likes the fruit that grows there. But recently, a new type of monster has come to live there, and she can't go and get her fruit anymore. Maybe if you got rid of the monster, or brought her some of that fruit, she might be- she might forgive you and open up a bit. People always warm up to someone who's helped them. Hope it works. Good luck. Thanks. This is all your fault. I got a couple of quests in the forest, it looks like now. Is that everything I can do here? Yeah. Should I get more onion, 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 onion seeds while I'm here? And then we can go back and plant them. Because I only got one. So let's just get, like, maybe another one. Give me some seeds. Thank you. I only got one more, but that's fine. That's, that's all we need, I think. And we'll go home. Plant. See where we're at on time. Maybe go to the Jade Forest. Wait. What is this? Whose house is this? Why do they have a thing in front of it? Do they all? Oh, they all do. I just haven't been paying attention. No. Can I just break into this person's house? <laughs> it's like I didn't learn my lesson last time. Hmm. Is that a chest? Wait a second. I didn't know you could do that. Okay. I just stole. <laughs> but that's okay. Oh! Oh, it's the inn! I didn't know there was an inn here. Huh. Let's use this to go home. Let's go plant. Now we got our new and improved plow, too. Can I have a snack now? Oh, 
so needy. Oh. <laughs> she said, BAM! <laughs> Alright, let's plant our seeds. We got a lot of these seeds. Gosh, I'm running, I'm running out of room! Ah! Five more? Can I even fit them? I don't know if I can fit all this. Two more. Where can I fit? Can I do here? Okay, I just need to put one more somewhere. Uh... Oh, there's spots over here? I'm dumb. <laughs> okay. Yay! Let's... It's 640. Let's just venture to the Jade Forest and see what's going on. Because I have a return bell. So if I need to, like, come home, I'll come home. And the Jade Forest is down. I remember that because I went there on accident last time. That was fun. That was an accident. Directions are hard. <laughs> they said... Oh, Jesus, they scared me. Oh, my God. I forgot I had people with me. Ah, this is who's watching the child. Who are you? Wait, is that Dianthus? No. Who's this? Okay, my turn. Receiving orders. Copy that. About to commence mission. Those humans are going down. Duran Repis? Duran Repis. I'm gonna call him Duran. <laughs> Your perception is skewed, little boy. My mission is to preserve the environment. I am not here to attack Abel's. Oh, really? Yes. I am maintaining the ecosystem in this very forest through my cloud. Huh, I don't know what an ecosystem is, but that sounds cool. Who's that? He's hiding behind him. Who is? What is going on? I see you read my letter. Many thanks. I'm not gonna ask if he kidnapped him. It's rude. What are you doing playing with a kid? I did not mean to play with him, but he asked me to, and I could not leave him on his own. Apparently, the game is called Princess and the Omen. I found this boy wandering around looking lost while I was carrying out my routine environmental checks. First, I ensured his safety, and then began to search for someone who could take him back to Lake. So you wrote to me. That's right, you're a sharp one. This saves me some trouble. Could you possibly take him for me? Alright, little boy, you can go home now. No! What? <laughs> I'm never, ever going back to the village. Ever. Oh, God. We got a missing child. Where are your parents? This does not add up. Children are supposed to be with their parents. Why would he refuse to go back? Exactly. Where are his parents? And after I explained at such lengths to him that it is dangerous to go any deeper into the forest. Well, he's a, he's a child. We have to catch up to him. Yes, you're right. At any rate, the situation has become complicated. We must resolve it. Let's go after the boy. Are you gonna... Follow me? Okay, so wait, I came in from there? Is that what happened? I came from here? Yeah, okay. Let's go this way then. Ooh, it's a level 13? That's okay, I have party members. Here's one of the fruits. I think. This must be the fruit that the lady was talking about. Yep. Best to take as much fruit as possible. Let's gather some more. Ooh, I brought a repair kit. Oh, I have to repair it from the other side. <laughs> That's lame. Where are all the bad guys? Why is this spot so empty? It seems weird. There's still not enough. Let's get some more. Mm, let's go this way. <laughs> Just kidding, let's go this way. <laughs> Good job, guys. Way to go. Oh, there's a the fruit. Wait, are you still fighting? What's going on? What was that? What is happening? What is that noise? Oh, they're being poisoned. Oh, I'm so dumb. I'm like, what is that noise? Oh, it's time to go to bed, too. Wait, hold on. Hold on, I got stuff. We can eat this. Eat it. There you go. This is the last fruit. Let's go. Let's just get this and then go, we'll go home. Hopefully this should be enough for Sharon to talk to you again. G 
Scar. Uh oh. Oh no, I didn't know this was gonna be a boss battle. This must be a new monster that the lady was talking about. You've gotta take it down. I hope I'm not too low a level for this. Okay, hold on. Fight it. I hate that they don't attack until you attack. I'm about to get in trouble. For being out late. What did it need? Oh. Looks like a ring. It's got someone's name on it. It says Sheeran. Uh oh. You've got the fruit, so head over to the house for now. I hope that I did not just kill that lady's husband. Can we just- will we make it to Lathe? What? Mm. Mm. I'm pushing it on time. I know that. I'm aware. And I'm about to have repercussions, but I want to know what's happening. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time for this, but we're gonna try. There's another exclamation point now, too. Let's see. It's pretty late. Try visiting another time. Oh, no! Okay, wait. We can use the return bell. I think if I- as long as I use it before noon. I just want to see what this exclamation point is. Can I jump? I can't. Who is this? Lis- Lislet. Hmm, what should I do? I can't just leave it there. It could cause trouble for someone. What will cause trouble? Ah! Oh, it's you, Taylor. Don't scare me like that, gosh. Anyway, I'm glad you're here. There's one over there. One what? Oh, not a ghost again. A ghost, a ghost. There's a weird voice coming from the old well. A terrible, scary voice. Everyone thinks this town is haunted. You don't believe me, do you? You go and look down the well then. Hear the scary evil ghost for yourself. Maybe it's a child. <laughs> okay, get closer. Now listen carefully. A voice comes from the well. Ah, enough. Ah, this be soon. I can't wait. All down. Hee 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 hee. See, you heard it, right? It said something's happened soon and it can't wait till it's all down. <laughs> it must be an awful evil ghost coming to destroy our village or it could just be someone drunk fell down the well. What? Wait, stop it. Who's there? A fearful presence comes from the well. Eek! Let's get out of here. No! There's someone down there. Gasp! We lost the go, right? You look unharmed, too. Phew, what a relief. Well, at least that settles it. There's definitely an evil ghost living in that old well. It must be saving its energy now to come out when it's ready. We can't leave it there. You're right, we have to do something. First of all, we should let everyone know. Can I leave that to you? Sure, we'll have to come back another day. The mayor meets with all the villagers in the afternoon at the square with the fountain. Everyone should be there. I'll keep an eye on the well, just in case. I'm still super scared of it, though. Anyway, it's getting late, so let's call it a day. You can make, you can make a start from tomorrow. Thanks, I'm counting on you. I mean, it's probably just literally like a person. But okay. We have to get back. Can we get home in time? If I use this. I think so. Because I think as long as we're home before midnight. Look, now I'm in my house. I'm home. We can... I can not get in trouble. <laughs> wow. you did oh, yay! Okay. Plow skills. Stamina down. Yay! Next we get... Ooh, fermenting barrel level 2. That's gonna be nice. And flour mill level 2. Cool. So let's go to bed. We'll have to go back into Leith at some point and figure out if I just murdered that woman's husband. Highly possible. Um, and if there's a drunk man down the well. That's where I'm at. <laughs> With those, I feel like I just murdered that man's husband and got turned into a beast or something. That man, that woman's husband got turned into some sort of beast. It's kind of like Fable, the werewolf. Y'all remember that? Just happened. <laughs> oh. We'll go back another time. Today we'll go to the Heaven's Egg. What's that noise? Is it Arya? Oh, right. My kitchen! <laughs> Hi. Fancy seeing you here in my house, sir. 
Hey, good morning. Did I wake you? Sorry about that. I just finished building the kitchen counter you requested. Is here a good place for it? I didn't have a choice. <laughs> Great. In that case, allow me to explain how to use it. You can make food using the kitchen counter. In order to make food, you will need a recipe and the necessary ingredients. You can buy recipes from stores or earn them as rewards, so keep an eye out. I love cooking in games. I don't know why. Most of the time it's, like, useless, but I love cooking. Eating food not only eases hunger, but it replenishes stamina, too. Also, cooking is cheaper than store-bought food. It's nice to trying out different meals when you're in the right mood. I can cook so long as I have a recipe. A recipe A, in that case, ooh, that's right, give me some. Thank you. You received a mountain stir fry recipe. I heard people like this recipe. Why don't you try using this recipe for starters? It's simple and easy enough for even beginners to master. Ah, uh, it's on the house. Consider it a freebie. Anyway, I'd best get moving. Do excuse me. If there's ever anything else you need building, then we can talk over at my place. I think that's what he said. I clicked A before I was finished reading. <laughs> Let's try it. Check the letter from Cress. How to spend money. I know how to spend money. <laughs> I can make it, right? I can make it. 20 minutes? Let's do it. Yeah, that's fine. It's asking, I see, it's asking if I want to use a fancy one. But that's fine. We'll use a fancy one. Yay! Look at it! It's so cute! Ah! Mountain stir fry. A dish made of fresh wild leaves and little mushrooms. The flavor shines in this simple but tasty local dish. From Lake. Local to Lake. Okay. That's the only recipe I have, though. That's sad. Thought I would have. Maybe you like can't get them. Okay. Yay! Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Okay. We got lots to do today. Today's a busy day. Busy day. Oh right, she's gonna ask me to do stuff. That's oh, oh. Okay. There's a lot going on. New products from the general store. Thank you for your continued patronage. We are pleased to announce that we are now selling new food recipes. Okay, that explains it. You couldn't get recipes until you got the kitchen. We have a wide selection including hamburger and sandwich recipes. Learn to cook a variety of dishes will not only add excitement to your life, but it is also a sure to come in handy on your adventures. Give one or of our new recipes a try. I am struggling to read today. Okay, I have a request. I know this is sudden, but would you mind bringing an ingredient to the clinic? We'll call it payment for your medical bills, although I may have to keep making such requests going forward. For now, could you bring me two cool leaves? You can find them at the Nord Steep. Okay. We've got a plan. Thanks for helping us find a present for Malika. Mission Super Sorry was a total success, but then we found out Malika's moving town. You just leave that to us, though. I've already got a super secret plan. You have to keep it this a secret, too. Don't say a word to Malika. See you later. You can't. She has to move. The more prepared you are. Black pearls? Why? How are you holding up, Taylor? Have you gotten used to your new life yet? I bet you're finding that you're spending more and more money buying seeds and expanding your farm. Well, I've attached a little something with this letter to help you along a bit. Sometimes when you get stuck from overspending, it's best to sell instead of buy, eh? Use this only when you really need to. Oh. Wait, can I take, I didn't take them. Thank you. My bad. Okay, nice. Thank you, Mayor. How helpful of you. Let's harvest. Our lettuce. Do we get juice? Oh, we got juice. Yes. Ooh, let's try. I don't. Let's just do the lettuce because I don't want to accidentally. I don't have any wet leaf. Um, I don't want to accidentally use the fruit that I'm supposed to give to that woman. I don't know if you even can, but just in case, we do be out here farming. I don't know. I like the farming in this game. It's so simple. So nice. Okay. Let's collect because I always collect these two spots and then let's go to What is that one town called? I don't remember the town's name, but we're gonna go there. Bye bye. Bye bye, Ember, your creepy voice. It's this way. Through the Njord Steep. We'll get Cress's cool leaves later. I don't care. Oh nice! Oh that is so simple. Oh that's wonderful. <laughs> that worked so nice. I love that. And then if you wanted to go into the Njord Steep, you could just press A. Oh, I didn't need to go into town. I don't think. Where's Heaven's Egg? How do I get to the Sea's Light? There. Got it. This is what the Sea's Light? Why is there a town at the bottom of the Sea's Light? Why are there buildings at the bottom of the Sea's Light? Hmm. 
weird. It was way easier to get here than I expected, yeah. Well, the research team has done a good job of maintaining this route, but we'll need to be on our toes from here on out. The inside will be teeming with monsters. This is not gonna, we're not gonna get to the heaven's sake today. This is a dungeon. Got it. How can this, this is what the inside of that egg? Then it must mean, oh, we're inside the egg? Did you find a clue or something? There's a town inside the egg? No, nothing like that. I'm developing a hypothesis, but I'll keep quiet until I know for sure. Let's keep going. I don't even know where to begin. So maybe I should have just gone to late today because this isn't gonna get done, but that's, is this where we came from? Wait, I'm a little lost, hold on. Okay, there we go. That's how we get it, okay. Um, wait, which way am I supposed to be going? Which way is which? I'm confused. Let's try this way. I think this is it. Yeah, there's arrows, so I think this is the right way. What level are you, sir? 12? Great, we got poison. Can I jump? I have a feeling I can't jump. Don't even try, Taylor. Don't even try. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Firelight fruit. Okay. Pink aloe! Cute! Oh, there was someone there the whole time? How did that even happen? Oh no, I'm gonna get poisoned. I wish they would... I don't know. I get why they don't, like, just auto-attack. Because with the fears and stuff, that would be not good. But I also wish they didn't. <laughs> There's an unusual fruit growing on the vines on the wall. Maybe you should try it. It might taste nice. Why not? Shake the vine gently and a fruit drops down. It cracks open as it lands. It's ready to eat. You take a bite of the fruit. It's so sweet and juicy. Your health and stamina have been replenished. You see another fruit up on the wall. You could try shaking that one down too. No. You decided to leave the vine alone and get out of there. Yeah, I don't trust that. No way is it going to be, like, two good things. Okay. Give me all your things. Rainbow beans! <laughs> I love rainbow beans. Cool. You really don't need to, like, buy seeds in... Oh, yes! I think the merchant is in Shatola for that, so that's exciting. But yeah, you really don't need to buy seeds in this game. If you just do the dungeons and look around, eventually you just find them. Which is nice. Ah. Hold on. I don't want to be eating certain things. What is this? A rainbow. I don't want to eat the rainbow bean. Let's eat the lettuce. We'll do the lettuce. For now. Oh, 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 gosh. Oh, help. Help. I also want to go to Lathe today because I know I'm not going to get through the dungeon in time. So, um, we'll spend some time in the dungeon and then we'll go back to Lathe. That way we have, like, story development. <laughs> What is that? Some plant is in the way. Looks like you'll need something to remove it. Okay, I don't think I have that. Oh, I got copper ore, finally. I can upgrade my weapon if I want to. Is everyone all right? Yes, everyone's fine. Oh, except for you guys. <laughs> Ooh. Is there something back here? Yep. Tangled rat, tingle radish. Cool, we're getting new fruits and stuff too this there are lots of boxes you might find something interesting if you check inside them yes 30 minutes later you checked inside several boxes but didn't find anything be useful maybe you should keep going you might find something if you look harder yeah 30 minutes later <laughs> you check every nook and cranny and find an item in the box in the back. Thank God you received two firelight fruits and two natural fibers. I don't know if that was worth it though. <laughs> I don't think it was worth it. Whoa! Oh no! Oh no! I'm lost. Botanical wall. How do I get through a botanical wall? Do I need to be a certain class? How do I switch classes again? Here we go. Is it this one? Oh, okay, so yeah, I needed to be a certain class. Use a potion. Oh, no! Wait, maybe I didn't. Maybe I just needed that. I just needed the, um, the fire potion thingy. Oh, I can't switch back? Oh, no, I messed up. I didn't realize. Okay. It's okay, we'll keep going. Thank gosh. Okay, and we're back. 
Real it's not. You're fine. Chill out. You're fine. Fine, girly. Okay, there's a ladder over here. We gotta do that. Yeah. Oh gosh, it's getting late. I wanted to go to late. But that actually makes it so that we can go back. So let's, yeah, let's go back home. It should be fine. We'll come back another day. Right? We actually are better off using the return bell. Because not only do we have to go through like the North Steep and stuff to get to town, it would have been a lot. So let's, it's gonna be too late. Did I make, did I do a boo-boo? It's still gonna be too late to go in the house. Should I have stayed? <laughs> let's see what we can do. Yeah, I think it might be too late. Let's try, I guess. You never know, but I think it's gonna be too late for us to go into the house, but we can go to that other character story. And we'll come back first thing tomorrow morning, do the character story, and then probably save and we'll go back to the dungeon or something because I am pushing it on time here. Dang it. Fine. Let's see what this character story is. I have to ramp. Oh, it's Cress. Do I even have what she needs? Is it just gonna... I don't, I don't know. Let's go and see. I don't think I have what she needs. Oh, gosh. It's too late. Okay, let's just go home. <laughs> we'll come back into town first thing. We will come back first thing tomorrow morning, do the quest, and then I'll probably save. And we will. Hi, Arya. Um, and then we'll go back to Nord's Deep starting next episode, depending on where, what time we're at. Yeah, we did level up. No, I didn't make any money. <laughs> Ooh. Good morning, Taylor. Sorry to catch you so early in the day, but would you mind coming with me? Okay. Here. Oh, yes, finally. It's a bomb recipe. Take it. Thank you, Arya. You received a bomb recipe. You need to make one of those. But bomb? Yes, a bomb. What, you've never used one before? I noticed a rock with a crack in it when I was out exploring the other day. You've seen it too, right? It looked like there was a path hidden behind it. I think you should be able to break it pretty easily with just one of those simple bombs. Why don't you take some with you next time you are out traveling? I bet you'll find something interesting behind hiding behind there if you split it in half. You can break down walls at break points. You need a bomb to break down a wall and you can get a bomb by crafting one. So there's places on our property and places in the dungeons that need those recipes. Ooh, I can do it. Let's make one. Yes. Nice. Cool. Maybe we should do the one on our property too and see what that is all about. Any letters? Nope. But we can harvest. We can make some flour too. Cool. Give me this. Take another one. Farm work is pretty good when exercised. And take that. And then we also have some seeds, I think. Yep. Cool. And then we got new ones. Tingle radish. Cool. Let's also put stuff in here. Oh, I can upgrade weapons now. Yeah, we're going to do that too for sure. We'll keep that on us. Where was the bomb? Oh, wait. I have a quest in my own yard? Who is that? Oh, it's Malika. What is she doing here? Taylor, do you have a minute? Is it just you today, Malika? I'm not gonna say I'm busy. She came looking for me. I wanted to talk to you about Van and Ben. They've been acting really weird today. I asked them if they wanted to play together, but they made some funny excuses and then ran off. Isn't that super mean? I can't believe they would ignore me like this. It's so rude. You were playing with them before, right, Taylor? Did they say anything to you? <sighs> Actually, they found out you're moving. I'm gonna spill the beans, so it's fine. Oh no. You tell Malika about how Van and Vent discovered she was moving away. Yeah, they're not gonna tell her, so. So that's why they're acting this way. This is all my fault. I'm sorry, Taylor. You must have been surprised too. 
Ma and Pa are merchants, so we move to new and different places all the time. But it looks like business has gotten bad, so we have to move and try and save it. Aww. You gotta do what you gotta do. That's what they said. If the business goes under, then we'll be in big trouble. Honestly, I wouldn't move at all if I could help it. But that would be really selfish of me to say. My parents would be so sad. I've been looking for the right time to talk to Van and Vent ever since I found out we were moving, but I could never find it. The right time never came, and now you have to talk to them. They're your friends. They can come visit. Yeah, I know. So I need to talk to them today. I can't keep avoiding it anymore. Taylor, will you help me? Of course. Thank you. Okay, first things first. We have to go find them. They ignored me and ran off earlier, so we need to figure out where they went. I'll be waiting in Lake Village when you're ready. Don't take too long, okay? Come here, small child. Van events top secret mission. Alright, so there is a place on my farm that has a bomb. Here. That's a tree. <laughs> That's looking at the map. Okay, here we go. Let's blow this up. Oh, is it just a shortcut? Oh. Well then. Where the heck did I just go? I didn't know this was a thing. Weird. I don't... I thought that was going to take me to the town. And there's other little areas too. Okay. Um, let's explore the farm for a second. I think I can repair the bridge over there and get like a chest. So I want to do that for sure. I don't think I can blow down that other bomb though. I think that requires you have... A uh, higher level bomb recipe, I'm pretty sure. That's what it looks like. And if I remember, there was like a bridge up here. Oh! Oh! Ooh, uh. Okay, I was wrong. There's not a bridge. I don't have that yet. Oh, hey, hold on. Maybe it's up there. And then I'll check out that other little area. I wonder why they put a modus there. It's a long run. Chase! So, this is where you need a level 2 bomb. That's not happening. Okay. And then what is up here? Oh, this is where I meant to go. Okay. Yeah, so there's something I can repair. Here we go. Let's do it. Give me that chest. What is in that chest? Ooh, a recipe! Ketchup omelet? That sounds kind of gross, but okay. Ooh, and we can get this modus. Yes. Nice. Okay, that makes things a lot easier. So, like, your gather points have lotuses. And then, let's go back down. And there's one more way we can go, which I think is the well that you can explore during Quietus, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so... Wait! How do I get that? Chest over there. How do I get that? Huh. And then let's just see what this is. Oh! Can't see what that is. That'll unlock, I'm sure, at some point. Okay, let's go to town. Cool. But at least we know now that we've kind of accessed everything Bye -bye. on the farm that we possibly can. There's a lot of quests that we can do into town right now, so... Oh, she's right here. Hello! Okay, so where should we start looking? Do you have any ideas? Mm -hmm. They're your friends. None whatsoever. I stopped by their house and asked there before going to see you, Taylor. But it sounded like nobody had any idea where either of them could have gone. What do you think we should do, Taylor? Let's try searching the village for now. Maybe that's all we can do. No, it isn't. That's just going to waste time. Ugh, what a pain. We need to ask people around the village. Somebody has to know something. Okay, so clearly I chose the wrong answer there. <laughs> Let's get going. We can't sit around like this all day. Just leave the talking to me. I'll find out where Van and Vent ran off to. Okay, bye. I'm sad for you to leave. You're the only, like, little girl in town. <laughs> They're all little boys. I'm so just run around town. You're looking for Van and Vent, are you? Yeah, I saw those two lurking around here not that long ago. Said they were looking for an adult to take them out to Jade Forest. The Jade Forest? Why would they go there? Beats me. They tried asking me if I'd go with them, but I'm way too busy with the field. Thanks anyway, mister. They're at the Jade Forest. It's 
So Van and Vent went into the Jade Forest. Oh, Van and Vent? I saw them hanging around the village entrance. Really? Around what time? And not too long ago, I think. You should, still be, you should still be able to catch up to them if you leave now. I do wonder about those two. I hope they're not about to do anything silly. They are. Don't worry, when Taylor and I catch up with them, we'll give them both a serious talking to. Oh ho, I bet you will. Boys, let's- Al's business. Al's business. <laughs> Upgrade our weapon while we're here. Yay, I can finally do it. It's $500. But we'll do it. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. You sound really old, but I know you're not that old. Oh. Who are these people? Not again. This is a third one now. We have to do something to stop them. Oh, yes, Taylor. What is it? I mean, you want to talk to the mayor? Well, he should be here any minute. Oh, right, we're going to talk about the well. Sorry to keep you waiting. Mayor, it looks like another farm has been ruined. Yeah, well, I mean, not all of it, but a big portion of it has been bitten through. By the looks of the bite marks, it's got to be mice. I trace the droppings, and it looks like their nest is inside the old well. The old well? Mm, Taylor, is something the matter? Yeah. This just got weird. A ghost in the old well? You heard strange noises and a voice coming from it? You must have confused the mice for a ghost. Well, we must deal with it at once. So those noises came from mice? They didn't. Yeah, the noises you heard were probably coming from the mice that have settled inside the well. It's not. We were just discussing how to deal with them with the mayor. Hey... What if it's the unicorn? What if the unicorn is living down the well? I don't know, we'll find out. Hey, that well is totally out of use, right? Since it's never used anyway, why don't we cover it up? No, there's someone down there. Mice don't talk. Yeah, it's not a bad idea. It's safer for the kids anyway. We wouldn't want them falling down there. Absolutely not. Uh, Mayor, why not? That old well is our reserve if anything happens to the monolite. We can't just cover it up. So we leave the mouse nest down there? Certainly not. The last thing we want to do is let them continue wreaking havoc. We might not be able to cover up the well, but we will wipe out every last one of them. Whoa, you're getting really fired up. I didn't think you would get so emotional for this. Of course I would. Because of those darned mice, my exquisite... Er, never mind. You were saying? Well, how are we going to get rid of the mice without blocking off the well? Hmm, Taylor, could I ask you a favor? I need you to make an extra strong mouse repellent. Sure. I appreciate it. There are some monsters in Hygen Canyon called Chlorogels. Their slime can be used to make a powerful mouse repellent. They're a bit dangerous, but you'll be fine. I'll leave it to you. I have to go back to Hagen Canyon anyway because I did not finish that dungeon. I was running out of, um, I, I ran out of space, so I didn't collect a lot of stuff. Okay, I think this way to that old house. All right. Hi, Shirin. I have something for you. You're here again. I told you to stay away. I brought you fruit to apologize. That fruit is from the Jade Forest. There was a monster. You beat it? I don't get it. You went into the Jade Forest just to bring me fruit? Hold on. I don't know who gave you the idea, but for you to put yourself in danger just so you can talk to me, you're a pretty stand-up person. I broke into your house. That's the least I can do. <laughs> anyway, come in. Thanks for the fruit and the monster. I'm sorry I called you a burglar before. No, you don't have to be sorry. I, I kind of was. I was really stressed, but that's no excuse. It was uncalled for. Yeah, it's my fault for letting myself in. I'm glad we've cleared that up. So, um, what did you come here for that time? You said you wanted to talk or something? Talk about the rumor. I've heard that rumor. So you came to see if it was true. I'm keeping this house clean so that it will be ready whenever he comes home. He's not dead. He's coming back. He's not coming back. How can I be so sure? Because I'm his lover. That's why I can't give up hope yet. Maybe he got eaten by that monster. 
You see, before that house got abandoned, the man who used to live there was a mercenary, but he got sent out of town on a mission once and never came back. Everyone seems to think he's already dead. But I don't. I'll believe that when I see it with my own eyes. You're a strong person. I just don't believe in giving up. Am I going to show her the ring? What? You ask her about the ring you found in the forest. You found a ring with my name on it? And the monster had it? I'm sorry, I know nothing about it. What should I do with it? I don't know. Something about it gives me the creeps. But either way, it's yours now. Do whatever you want with it. It's about time I went back to my own house. Please let me know right away if you find out anything about him, okay? See you. I have a bad feeling he was eaten by that monster or something, and he was wearing that ring because he loves you. That's what I think happened. Whoa, I'm circling around. Wait, maybe this is the chest behind you. <laughs> Found it. Cool. Well, that's really sad. I have a bad feeling her lover is dead, um, and that was his ring or something. And she told me, I'm not going to get rid of it, though, because I hope it's an option to like give it to her. That's really sad. You're looking for those two troublemakers, are you? Come to think of it, I overheard them earlier having some kind of strategy meeting in the village square. Don't suppose you were able to hear what the strategy meeting was about? Not really, just mumblings about smelliness and quantity. It was all very suspicious. Mark my words, those two are up to no good. You let them know I'm on to their mischief if you find them, won't you? Oh, believe me, I will. A strategy meeting, what are those two planning? Well, they're in the Jade Forest, so we have to go. Or they get killed. It sounds like Van and Vent went, wanted to go to the Jade Forest for some reason. They should know better than to leave the village. You don't suppose they've gone out on their own, do you? I really hope not. Me too. Those two can be so reckless. Then we should get moving. I'll run on ahead. See you there. No. That... Again. Like... You guys are not supposed to be... <laughs> Alright. Whatever. They're not here. Do you think they've already left the village? Somebody must have seen them. Excuse me, mister. Have you seen Van and Vent around? Van and Vent? I think they said they were going to the Jade Forest. Hold up. Weren't you supposed to go with them, Taylor? No, they lied. They're liars. Wait, what? Taylor's been with me the whole time. Now that's strange. They said Taylor was going with them. I can't believe it. Those two lied so they could go into the Jade Forest alone. We have to hurry and find them. You're right. Let's go. Maybe they're at my house. Taylor, let's go to the Jade Forest. I'll go to the Jade Forest, but I have a... Like, maybe they went to my house to come find me. To ask me to go with them. To the Jade Forest. <gasps> no! Unicorn Forest? Wait a second. What the heck is Unicorn Forest? I should go there. I bet you that's where the unicorn is. Oh, here they are. Good. Come here. There they are, Taylor. Look. You guys were right by those monsters. You're lucky you're alive. Ooh, wah. Shh, keep down, Vent. Or do you want... Do you want to get us both caught by a monster? Yeah, they were, like, literally right there. And could you pick up the pace? This isn't nearly enough to... Ooh, wah. That's way worse than a monster. Who are you calling worse than a monster? I can't believe you can be so rude. And after we spent the whole day looking for you two. Looking for us? What for? Because we were worried about you. What are you doing anyway? Collecting seeds? Well, well we're... Vent, don't you say a word. Fine, don't tell me. That's not why I'm here anyway. I wanted to talk to you. Malika, wait. Huh? You don't have to tell us anything. We're already working on it. Working on what? Are they trying to help restock her dad's shop? We've got it covered, okay? Come on, let's go, Vent. Hey, hey, slow down. What? Wait just a second. Shall we go after them? I think they're just trying to help her dad's shop from going out of business. Totally, those two are definitely hiding something. Looks like they ran back to the village. Come on, let's follow them. I think they're just trying to help. If I go... A little over to the left. There's a quest back here. And then we'll go back to the village. Is this the boy? Or is it more about... Oh, it's the boy. 
Hey, buddy. What you doing? Help, mom, dad! Stand back. Leave this to us. Well, this isn't that hard. It's just a... Oh, I guess it's level 16, so... Fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. No, it wasn't. You didn't help. <laughs> I don't know why this person is here. Target elimination confirmed. The child is also confirmed safe. Wow, you're so strong. Thank you. Why did you go further into the forest knowing that it's dangerous? I thought I advised you... No, strongly warned you not to. Because... Did you not take my warning seriously? Isn't it easy to see that the forest would be dangerous for a defenseless child like you to go to all by yourself? The child. I'm sorry. And what you said earlier was inscrutable. Why did you refuse to go back to your parents? It is extremely difficult for a child to survive without a parent's protection. Staying here would be highly illogical. Because... Wah! You asked too many questions at once. I will leave it to you then, Abel. You would know how to talk to your own kind. Why don't you want to go home? Because mommy and daddy are never home. They're always working, and I'm always left all on my own. I eat on my own, sleep on my own. Other kids don't have to do that. Your parents work so that they can provide a stable environment for you. No, they don't. They hate me. They leave me on my own because they don't love me anymore. You have to come. You have come to the wrong conclusion. What do you mean? It is said just. It is said that just as much as a child depends on their parents, parents depend on them too. It is improbable that your parents would leave you on your own without reason. First, you should ask them for their reason and understand the basis for their actions. I don't know what all these big words mean. He's saying you should talk to them. I presume that the problem here is a lack of communication. Why do you want to send me home so much? Even though you spent all that time playing with me. I was not playing with you. I was only protecting you. Ooh. Do you hate me too? It is not about liking you or hating you. I am trying to restore order and put things the way they should be. I am not meant to be your protector. We have our own role to play and I, my own mission to complete. You are getting in the way of that mission. Fine then, I'll go back. Can I leave him with you? Yeah, I'll take him. You have my thanks. Okay, let's get these chests. Thank you. Thank you. And we'll go home. Well, we'll go to town. What time is it? Five, six o'clock? We had a little bit more time. We can probably figure out why Malika is being the way that she is, but I gotta make sure I'm going the right way. There they are. No, this is that kid. Wait, fine. Let's get you home. Wait. I don't want to go home. I bet my mom and dad aren't even worried about me because they don't love me. You've got to talk to them face to face. Even if I wanted to, they're not even at home. I'm staying in the forest. Oh my god. Ike! Oh, thank god. Oh, thank goodness. We were so worried. Mom, Dad, what are you doing here? We were looking for you everywhere, naturally. Where were you all this time? Are you hurt? I hope you didn't see anything scary. Don't you need to be at work? Ike. You are much more important to us than work. But, but you're always at work, and you never spend any time with me. We're sorry, Ike. You've obviously been feeling very lonely. You've had to put up with us being absent for so long, when really, we should have been at home indulging you this whole time. Mom, Dad, talking was the right thing to do. Yeah. Sorry I made you worry. As long as you're safe, that's all that matters. Come on, I've got a nice hot dinner ready for you at home. I'm going home now. Thank you for sticking with me. Could you thank that omen for me too, please? 
I will. If he's still there to thank, that is. Well, see you later. Thanks again. Okay, you can stop waving now. <laughs> okay, so this really was just like an introduction to that omen. Wait. This isn't what I thought it was. Grumble. I give up. Oh, okay, it is. Gah! Well, what is that smell? My poor, beautiful nose, it feels like it's going to fall off. That is one hell of a smell. Ugh, I think I'm gonna cry. Excuse me, ma'am, what's going on? This is the work of those rascals, Van and Vent. They came screaming back here and barricaded themselves inside the mayor's house. Well, why would they do that? I was asking myself the same thing. The mayor's in there negotiating with them now, but they're being stubborn little horrors. Probably is. As soon as you get anywhere near the house, they start throwing those stinky seeds at you. I have no idea what it is they hope to get out of this, but... What should we do, Taylor? I'll shield you while you talk to them. Aw, <laughs> oh, Taylor, okay, let's give it a try. Taylor and I are going to the mayor's house. But, but, Malika? Man, Ben, get your butts out here right now. Malika? What do you two think you're doing? You shouldn't be here. Get out of here right now, I said. Eek! Man, Malika's super mad at us. C calm down, will ya? We still have our secret weapon. If so much as one of those stinky seeds touch touches me, then we are over. Erk! You don't want to mess with Malika, guys. Okay, okay, we're coming out. So, you finally come to your senses, have you? We said we'd leave as soon as you agreed to our demands, didn't we? And I'll tell you again. What you're asking is outside of my control. The hell it is! That's enough. Eep! What are you two doing? Everyone in the village is furious. Let them be. We did this for you, Malika. But why? We came to talk to the mayor, get him to stop you from moving away. We thought that, since he's the mayor, he'd have the power to keep you here. It's not like you even want to go, right, Malika? So if the three of us talk to the mayor, then maybe together we can... You idiots! How could you both be so stupid? Nothing you can do is going to stop me from moving away. I have to go, for Ma and Pa. But, but, I don't want you to. You're being so selfish. Sometimes we have to do things in life that we don't want to do. She's right. <laughs> Malika, she's very wise for a young child. You've inconvenienced everyone in the village over this. You both need to apologize right now. Why are these kids like adults, honestly? Apologize? You're the one who should apologize. You kept this whole thing a secret from us. But I guess that's because it's no big deal to you, huh? You are happy to pack up and leave us behind. That's, that's not what we're here to talk about right now. This is about you and all the trouble you've caused. Why do you think we did it? Because you are ready to just go without saying goodbye. That's not it. Van, please, just stop. What? I know you're thinking it too. That's why she never told us in the first place. Okay, let's all just calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Come on, guys. I don't want us to fight. Stop it. Malika. I hate you, Van. Well, that escalated. I hate you. Just forget we were even friends. Malika, don't. Hmm. Well, this is a fine mess you've gotten yourselves into. Whatever. Let's go home, Van. You coming or what? Yeah, sorry. I'll be right behind you. This wasn't how it was supposed to go. I have to do something. Let's see. Uh, I have so many seeds now. <laughs> My farm is not big enough. Okay, well, let's go home. Go to bed and that'll be it. I can't do your quest yet, Chris. I don't have the leaves that you want. Maybe I can try and save up for a farm expansion. I think that needs to be first. Seven o'clock, I can still plant. I don't know if I have space. I think I have some space. I hope these can be planted. 
Oh, they can't. They are not. They are seasonal. Spring, summer, and fall cave crop. Grows in summer and fall in the spring. Fall. So will this not grow? Because it's not. Okay, yeah. So actually, we can't even grow those. Okay, let's grow this one. Do I have just enough spaces? I think I have just enough. Wow. Okay. Okay, so actually, I might want to hold off on doing the Heaven's Egg quest because there's probably going to be like a boss fight and I don't have as much like food as I did for that last one, which I'm going to need. But it, it takes like a whole day to make one juice. So I need to stock up on like juices and stuff. I think the thing to do would be to continue on with these sides quests while I stock up on juice and then go and do the the heaven's egg so like kind of just do all these little side quests that have been happening and i think that's probably gonna be the best way to go about things but let's make what we can i can only make one that's fine oh i can make another one or am i missing it do i have to have the golden wait what do i need to make the ketchup omelet i don't know oh huh. okay I need to go to bed but let's make did I use it? Yeah, I used it. So let's make another one. And we'll make another bomb. Maybe we should make a couple. Let's make a couple. Two bombs. Let's make one more repair kit. Just in case. And we'll go to bed and save. And then next episode, we'll do some side quests. Stock up on what we can food-wise. Maybe buy some uh, more recipes. Try and stock up on food and drink. And continue with the Heaven's Egg. And I think Quietus is coming up soon. I think we have maybe 10 more days or something, so we gotta be careful about crops and stuff. No cutscene! <laughs> so first, all right, that's where I'm gonna end it. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!